welcome to our channel. I'm Dee. I'm Kelly. And we are Sisters, Sisters of Stitchcraft. Stitchcraft. <laughs> 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 Well as that ever again. <laughs> you were here. <laughs> okay, so we thought we'd just come on, do a quick one, um, talk about scrap busting really. Dee especially, but myself too, we don't like wasting fabric, So, but we also tend to be the sort of girls that buys three or four metres every time we buy fabric, just in case we want to make a dress. Anyway, so what we did, we did make the Porsche dresses in this fab, these fabrics, I should say, not this that are not fabric, the same. <laughs> similar, not the same. Referring back to our other blog, our other blog, blog, blog? vlog <laughs> on the Porsche dress. Anyway, so we had enough left over to get a Seasons of East Spring, Spring in London, London top, which I'm loving mm -hmm. the 80s vibe, hence the totally. hair. Also, you've got a so over it bow bag out of that as well. I did line it with a different fabric, but got that. And I think I've got about three scrunchies. Yeah, I've got a scrunchie, but I forgot to put it in. <laughs> Oops. Amateur. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not gonna lie. <laughs> no, you wait till you see the catwalk, you won't yeah. think that. <laughs> <laughs> Chucked it up for the catwalk, forgot to change the scrunchie, so. Yeah. But that, so that's what we got. We got a Porsche dress, we got a top, I got a bag, we got scrunchies, and that was all out of three metres. I do meters. actually have some more left over as well. <gasps> I have no idea what to do with it. So, you know, um, answers on a postcard, as they used to say. How much have you got left over? Probably about half a metre. Quite a lot. Mm, you could make something mm. with that. Oh, I could. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's definitely, exactly. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm going to make with it. <laughs> So I'm, I'm surprised I have so much left over after I finish this. Absolutely. Mm. I've got a few odd bits um, and I'm thinking Christmas cards. Oh, that's cute. I'm thinking, who did I watch? Oh. Was it Sequin Girly, Sam Sequin Girly? And um, possibly, so let's sparkle with Sam. So all the Sams <laughs> in their Vlogmas, oh, I'm sure, yes. made Christmas trees and things. And I thought, well, it's so glittery and shiny. That would yeah, be perfect for yeah. that. Would you do that with free motion? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'd give it a go. <laughs> yeah, I've um, given yes. it a go once and it, I found it quite hard, but it's not, you need a bit of a skill, so I would practice before Christmas is all I'm going to say. My plan would be to do Christmas trees, mm -hmm. so probably to just go round in triangles yeah. rather than free motion and all over, but yeah. we'll, we'll see. Just it's a while away. <laughs> tinsel on the Christmas tree. <laughs> Have I got any metallic thread? I might have some metallic thread. Maybe you could just have a Christmas tree and card and then use this for a bit of tinsel across it. Oh yeah, could do that. Can I also say, incidentally, um, this bag, Kelly, please show them the inside of this bag. Oh, the inside of the bag. <laughs> the inside of this bag is also using scraps, I, I believe. It, oh, tissue. <laughs> I'm going here without tissue. So, shall I just How good is, I love the pink. Out against the silver i just think i can see it because i could see behind the bow which was popped. Uh, yeah i, so I did it. it on the other side of the bow yeah and i just it. think that just works really great with the, it's uh, just a little bit pretty a little bit yeah. different i thought it's almost reversible isn't it, it but is. not quite um <laughs> it wasn't actually scraps i think do you know when we first oh Oh, interesting, <laughs> round the wrong way. Um, when we first started sewing, and we first started sewing Glow Group, and Em and I both bought um, some fabric a couple of times, and from Pound Fabrics, I think I bought a metre of this fabric, or half a metre of this fabric, just thinking it was really cute. Oh, well, I thought it was what you'd done Alana's bag in. No, that she had the um, horror yes, characters. Um, so yeah, so so not really scrap busting, but it was something that I had in my stash that I hadn't found a stash use busting. for. So stash busting too. <laughs> so there so you go. That name. <laughs> stash busting and scrap busting. scrap busting all in one item. <laughs> <laughs> and actually, it looks really cute as well with the matching outfit. But yeah, so that was it really. So we just thought we'd come on and do a little bit of sustainability yeah. scrap busting. We will do. Another sustainability we longer will. version because I've done quite a lot in the sense of 
denim stuff and patchworky stuff with leftover denims and stuff. So it's something we are going to do in the future, but this was a, just a quick one because we love these tops. <laughs> Any excuse them. to get them on, to be honest. I've not had a chance to wear it yet, so I'm Why really quite knows. pleased. Have yeah. you? I've not yeah. been anywhere. I don't really go anywhere. I could just wear it at home, I guess. Uh, only because it was like Matt's yeah. birthday wore out. Yeah, so but I, I love it. I finished mine with bias binding. So I've got... I just hemmed it normally. Sewing machines from also, the Specky Seamstress. I didn't line this. I don't know if anybody saw the one I talked about my Porsche. I actually lined the, my Porsche because... I was worried it was going to be see-through. I haven't lined this one. It's actually okay, isn't yeah, it's it? It's fine. I can't. I mean, when it's off, it looks really see-through, but actually, it doesn't on. It doesn't when it's on. So it's really, really yeah. quite amazing, really. But you could wear a vest top under it if you were a little bit worried about it. So yeah, yeah. or a little cami. Yeah, because I wasn't going to the whole lining it again thing. <sighs> too time-consuming no. <laughs> for a top that takes about half an hour to make. That was way too time-consuming. And that is cutting <laughs> out on everything. Yeah. Um, this top is definitely going to be my go-to scrap busting top. Yeah. I've got um, a couple of summer in New York's cut out and I've probably got enough on both of those fabrics, certainly on one of those fabrics to get another mm. one of these out. Um, yeah, not on both the fabrics because the Flamingo mm. one. I've used Flamingos. I've scrap busted with it quite a lot. Um, yeah. Yeah. And it's wearable. It. Mm. Under things over things dress it up dress it down i mean okay, this is a bit dressed up but you can dress it down if you did it in a more plainer <laughs> so anyway hope you enjoy the catwalk oh yes that's coming next <laughs> uh, just one item this time but look out for our frail one as well so yeah so enjoy the catwalk it is just a short one as Dee said and we will catch you soon happy, happy sewing. sewing bye, bye. Down the street with your